everybody, New Tap here. And today I received um, a very interesting toy. Um, it's kind of exciting because I've been working on this thing for uh, quite a while now. But um, maybe some of you have heard, but the entire team that worked on the Xbox One got a pretty sweet launch gift, which is an actual Xbox One special edition thingy, uh, which I received today. And I'm going to open it. It came in this sweet box, which, I don't know if you can see that, it's got this weird design on it. Um, it looks like a bunch of construction equipment building an Xbox logo. So that's kind of cool. So I got a few different things, and we're going to start with the console itself. So I'm going to use, I'm going to use this knife, because I'm metal like that, to open this. This is how you know it's a, a proper unboxing, because I haven't actually looked inside yet. No, I know what's in here. Everybody at work got, got these. So I've been seeing them all day. I feel like there's something still holding this. Yes, yes there is. It's on the bottom. Cute. You ready to open it? Come on, buddy. You can do this. Whoop. Let's take it off to the side. All right. Slick. I don't know if this is what the final packaging is going to look like for regular consumers. I have no idea. It's got the specs written on that side. Oh, this one says day one 2013 on it, on the controller. So I guess this is a day one edition? I think I've heard about these things. Uh, to be honest, what I work on isn't really related to packaging, so I'm not sure. Alright, moment of truth. The big reveal. Oh. More packaging materials. All right, let's let's go. Um, so I actually know how these things are packed because I've opened several of these before. But those were the kind of the dev kit packaging. But it's pretty similar to this. Yes, that new it's that new hardware smell. Um, the top section is going to have the connect and some other stuff. Let's get, let's get to the good stuff first, right? Let's take a look at the console itself. Actually, you know, we should lead up to that because I, I know what the console is going to look like, and that's the that's the culmination. All right, so this I actually think the packaging material is really well designed. This thing flips open, and inside we have a headset. We're just going to open everything. This is a headset. This actually looks a little bit mm, it's like slightly less flimsy than the 360 headset. I don't know. Maybe this. This is the um, little connector, which has di I guess digital volume up and down buttons and a mute. And it's got a cable. It's kind of got this flat, flat cable going. I don't know why. Whatever. I prefer to have my headset on the left side. Can I do that? Is this gonna let me turn it? Hmm. I prefer to have the headset on the left side. Why can't I do that? Oh, there we go. Roger. Let's put that away. Put that in my goodie pile over there. Thank you for being part of day one. That's what this says. Um, you're one of the first to experience a new generation of entertainment. Yes, I've been hearing that a lot. To commemorate this moment, we've created an exclusive day one achievement for you. Welcome to Xbox One. Oh, so I get a Chivo from this. I probably shouldn't show you guys the code, otherwise you'll steal my Chivo. Right? Okay. Goodie pile. Got this, uh, I don't know, is that a tattoo? Is it a bumper sticker? I'm not really sure. Put it, I'm, I'm sure I can find something to put it on. Oh, and they gave me a postcard. Thank you for being part of Xbox One. Well, you're welcome. You guys paid me too, so. Quick setup guide. I don't think I need that. Mm. This is a standard uh, PC power cable. Not interesting. Keep all the materials in the uh, junk pile, right next to the goodie pile, so not to be confused with. Power brick. Some of you guys complain about this external power brick, but why? Who cares? You put it behind your TV and it's, it's gone, right? It's a little sticky. Taking material. I'll even remove the, uh, well, 
plastic cling film from this. My wife loves ripping this stuff off. So it's getting a scab, right? Standard, uh, well, it's not standard, but it's the, the connector for it, whatever. I'll take that packaging off later. Nobody cares about that. Controller, we'll get that in a moment. HDMI cable included with the, with the box. That's a classy move. I like that. That's good. HDMI cable will go there. Jump file. All right. Controller number, oop, no spoilers. Controller. Bowden controller. On the inside, oh, you can't really see it. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that, but inside the battery compartment it says hello from Seattle. I don't know if it's a homage or mockery of the Apple hello from California. I don't remember what they said exactly. It's pretty good. Oh yeah, that feels nice. So this, this is not as advertised. On the side here, on the side here, this controller says Day 1 Edition. Oh, you can't see that. It says Day 1 2013, right in the middle of the controller. But mine says no such thing. Mine is just a regular controller. I, I'm not complaining. It's pretty sweet anyway. And they give you two AA batteries, which should last like a month. So that's cool. That goes not in the junk pile, but the goodie pile. All right, they've also managed to fit the connect in here. Look, check out this packaging. They kind of flip this little cardboard thing down and the entirety of the connect cable fits inside there. It's kind of neat. Remove the connect, which is considerably large in the three, 360s, make no mistake. Um, and they have, they, they don't want you to touch the front of it, so I'm not gonna undo this right now. But that is the, that is the connect. Uh, the 360s connect is not, I'm just gonna reveal it for comparison. Can't do this. Can't do this. It's stuck behind my TV the cable. But um, here, let's see. As a point of comparison, with the controller, it's not that big. Cool. I'll put that up later in the goodie pile. Close that back up. Close that back up. I have no idea how this went before. I have now completely lost track of how this went before. That looks about right. Put that over there. All right, console time. This is what we've been waiting for, right? The real meat. So interestingly enough, all the internal ones that I opened had white packaging. So there's all this stuff on the white. Who cares? So everybody has seen the the, the regular Xbox ones. They uh, have that. That deep black look. Let's take a look. Let us take a look. I'm inept. What can I say? Oh, what is this? Oh, that's nice. That is nice. So this is the special white edition, which is, I don't know, I think that looks really, really cool. I don't know if you're going to be able to read this either, but it says on here, I made this. Launch team 2013. That's that's me. That is what I did. All right, along the back, you've seen this in all the video reviews. Power, HDMI out, optical out, HDMI in. Don't get these two confused. Yeah, I did that before. It doesn't matter, actually, but you just won't get any signal out. Two USB 3 ports, connect port, IR out. What do you do with an IR out port? You know, I never actually used this. It's an IR out port and then your gigabit ethernet. Another USB 3 on the side. There's that um, uh, wireless pairing button for the controller. DVD drive, or sorry, Blu-ray drive, of course. And capacitive power button. Oh, gorgeous. I really, really like that. I'm just going to leave that there. Alright, the next cool thing is they gave us another box that had the same little construction logo on the front. What could be inside this? It doesn't say. It says, I made this 
launch team 2013 on there as well. Uh, I like this packaging. I may end up hanging on to it. I don't usually do that. Bring out the knife, because once again, I'm metal like that. Wouldn't it be funny if I just cut the heck out of myself on camera? How funny would that be? I'm oh, it's got a handle on the top. It's got like a weird little handle on the top. Oh, it's opening. Help. This is another controller. Xbox One wireless controller. So I guess this is a, an individually packaged controller. Um, let's take a look. So we've got one. Point of comparison. We'll leave that right here. Oh, we've got it upside down. <laughs> Let us take a look at this beauty. Oh my god, look at that. How sweet is that? Oh my god. Okay, you can't, you can't tell but this controller is all plastic. Uh, it's kind of uh, a matte feel of plastic. This one is a different material. I don't know what this is, but it's this. It, the bottom is almost kind of rubbery. It's, it almost feels like a rubber coating. Oh my god, this feels this feels incredible. We have to sell these things. People will. I would pay good money for another one of these. Holy crap, that feels so crazy. I wish I could convey in video what this feels like because this is amazing. Anyway, that's gorgeous. And also, uh, in the middle it says I made this, which I did. The D pad, man. That D pad works. And in here as well, they give you a couple more batteries. Anything else? A note? Nope. Nothing else in here. I'm putting a box back together on, on video. Unsuccessfully, I might add. Okay, good enough. More batteries for me. This beautiful controller. I'm not sure I'm going to let anybody else actually <laughs> touch this controller or use it for any extended period of time. Uh, I'm going to be selfish about this one. This is so cool. I saw my buddies taking them out at work, but I didn't actually touch them, so I don't know what they're like. Okay, we got four. We'll look at that in a second. We got four more things in here. Dead Rising 3, 2013 edition, or sorry, day one edition, because Microsoft publishes it. So I get all the stuff Microsoft publishes. That includes Rise, whether or not you care about it. It's pretty. Forza 5, which I don't particularly care about because because it's not burnout. And Zootikun, which uh, I care about less than my wife, but she is all about that. And finally, they seem to have given me a card. I didn't, re I didn't notice this in the packaging before. It's a little hard to see. I'll try and get the light to catch on it. Uh, it says Xbox One and kind of embossed on there. Thank you for making the Xbox One possible. We know that you, uh, we know that you also worked hard and made sacrifices so that your family member could be a part of the Xbox One ship team. On behalf of Microsoft and millions of Xbox, it's quite a mess. Guess I'm gonna go hook this thing up. Sweet. Guess I'm gonna go hook this thing up. Sweet.